Item number SCP-1750, Object Class Keter. Special Containment Procedures. The Foundation is collaborating with international government, automotive manufacturers, and environmental protection groups, agencies, or watchdogs to advance the development of and promote the adoption of hybrid, electric, and ethanol-powered vehicles while reducing the popularity of petroleum field vehicles. Mobile Task Force Mu-13 Ghostbusters is working with the Department of Analytics to investigate and neutralize both vehicles and petroleum reservoirs that may be affected by SCP-1750. Affected vehicles should be delivered to Foundation Disposal Site 93 for recycling. Description SCP-1750 refers to the spontaneous animation of petroleum-powered vehicles ranging from automobiles to propeller aircraft. Vehicles animated by SCP-1750 display animal-like behaviors with some similarities to crocodiles and birds. There does not seem to be underlying pan or cause behind the phenomenon. Exorcisms tailored for reptilian ectomorphs have proven the most effective at neutralizing SCP-1750 manifestations, which also end naturally once the vehicle runs out of fuel. Given this information, it is hypothesized that SCP-1750 is a result of dinosaur-based ectomorphs inhabiting the fuel in the vehicles. This would similarly explain why SCP-1750 has not occurred in immobile gasoline-powered machines. They may in fact occur, but there would be no way for them to actually move upon manifesting. Addendum Noted SCP-1750 Manifestations Montana a motorcycle rally goes awry when the vehicles are affected by SCP-1750, dislodging the riders and then attempting to mold them using the tires and exposed tailpipes. Injured and wounded riders tended to draw more attention from affected motorcycles. All affected motorcycles lured into a local junkyard by use of domestic chickens, where they are fenced in and exercised. All riding injuries blamed on improper vehicle handling. Class A amnestics dispersal ordered. Colorado, USA. An 18 wheel semi truck becomes affected by SCP 1750 while refueling. It proceeds to rampage through the city, sticking up on smaller vehicles such as sedans and copes and ramming into them to knock them over. Because the vehicle had not refueled fully, it exercised itself after two hours. The vehicle was destroyed and the event blamed on a drunk driver. Class C amnestics used. Bavaria, Germany. A crop dusting plane was affected by SCP-1750 mid-flight, rowing off course and flying to the Red Tuck River, where it lands and attempts to dig up the ground near the river by spinning its wheels along the ground. Plane ran out of fuel and exercised itself. Pilot and bystanders given Class C amnestics. Excavation of the soil revealed a small clutch of fossilized eggs hypothesized to belong to Pterodactylus anticus. Dalcon Mongolia A jeep and motor car are simultaneously affected by SCP-1750. All the jeep wanders the city, occasionally running over foliage and ramming into trees. The micro car attacks nearby civilians. The jeep eventually comes across the micro car, which accelerates into and rams it. The two vehicles proceed to engage in combat until a sudden sandstorm blows into the city and buries both vehicles. All affected civilians given Class A amnestics, destruction caused by the vehicles blamed on the sandstorm. Gulf of Mexico A crude oil tanker is affected by SCP-1750 and proceeds to submerge itself with the loss of almost all hands on deck. Following its submission, the tanker had been observed intermittently throughout the Atlantic Ocean, attacking small yachts and baleen whales and behaving in matters similar to a great white shark. 
The surviving crew members were given Class C amnestics. The affected tanker is still at large in addition to ongoing containment duties. The Foundation Atlantic Fleet has been ordered to keep watch for and neutralize the ship if it is spotted. The environmental damage estimated to result upon its destruction has been deemed within acceptable parameters by the Ethics Committee.